So the first reason is in verse 6, that is, God created. The second thing is in verse 7. For this reason, a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife. Not only is it God created, it's also God designed. There was a particular way with which God designed the family to be. There's a particular way with which God designed the marriage covenant to be lived out. And, it, and, and the whole plan was that there would be a, a family nucleus, that there would be a mother and a father and children. And then over here, there would be mother and father and children. And one of these boys would meet one of these girls, and they would both leave, and they would make a whole new family nucleus. And I realize that, again, in our culture today, that's not always normal, but that was the plan. And in premarital counseling, we call this leaving and cleaving. You have to do that. And sometimes it's more difficult than others. But there has to be a leaving and there has to be a cleaving. But here's what I want you to see about this. This is where this gets crazy. If God's design is for this new couple to leave their paternal relationship, not leave it like you never see your parents again, right? but leave it as in you don't live there under that authority anymore and to create their own family nucleus, then what God is saying is that this new nucleus is more important than the old one. Some of you moms are death staring me right now. I didn't write it, okay? My, listen, my relationship with Jackie Scott is more important today than my relationship with my mother I love my mother, and I want to, to honor my mom, support my mom, care for my mom, except for, in some cases, it's my brother's job. But either way, I, I, I want to do that, right? But the day that I said yes to her, I had to start saying no to my mom in some places, and my dad, and the same for her. And so what we see is the importance of, that God is placing on this new family nucleus. This is your primary ministry. This is the place that should get the most love and attention. This is the place that you should focus on the most in your life. I put in my notes, and again, some of you won't love this, but it said, I put in my notes, children were designed to leave the parents, not parents leave the children children are designed to leave the parents parents are not designed to leave the children that's why you should stay married and that's why you should be married and that's why you should encourage and love and care for those who are struggling and that's why you should pray for those who are in the midst of difficulty and that's why you shouldn't ignore what's going on in their lives. And that's why you should be willing to get in the middle of it and do everything you can. Because that's God's design. 